On the same day that more businesses are starting to open in the state, the governor addresses the state about a number of issues, talking about his decision to restart the state's economy, even though there's been debate about it, and also making a point to say that he and President Trump are on the same page. 11 Live reporter John Shirk was at the press conference. Johnny covered a lot of ground. What stood out to you the most? Governor Kemp and the Commissioner of the Georgia Department of Public Health, Dr. Kathleen Toomey, both said this afternoon that allowing businesses to begin to reopen was the correct and safe decision. Dr. Toomey said that Georgia met some key criteria to justify the reopenings, adequate and increasing hospital capacity, adequate and increasing testing capacity, and contact tracing capability. And they said the numbers are showing a plateauing of infections in Georgia, despite those who say the state is reopening too soon. You know, whenever you take a step, your model changes. It's like you almost get punished for taking a step depending on what model you're looking at. So we're not just relying on one model. We're relying on Dr. Toomey, what her team's seeing on the ground every day. We're better off, in my opinion, trusting people. Because I trust Judge Georgians. They're smart people. They're great entrepreneurs. They're hardworking and they're innovative. And it's incredible what they're doing to meet the guidelines. Governor Kemp said he may announce in the next few days what next steps he may authorize as the state moves forward. But he said even though the statewide shelter-in-place order expires as of Friday, he's still urging Georgians to self-isolate when possible and to stay at home when possible and to continue as if the order were still in place. Jeff, back to you. All right, John, thank you.